Hi everyone, Konnichiwa, it's Ryu from Japan and today I got a request to do a reaction video to 29 things that only exist in Japan so please enjoy watching this, yes, play! Japan is known as the land of the rising sun but it could also Yay. be known as the land Nippon. of singing toilets or the country of the blue oh. traffic light there are so many things that make it a whole other world get ready to explore 1. Square watermelons They were invented back in the 70s by a graphic designer to fit compactly oh. in the fridge and be cut more easily. Japanese farmers grow them in special containers to get the shape. Since they're pretty expensive, people don't buy them as food, but rather as a decorative item. I Two, didn't know it was only in Japan. Noodles bath. The Unison Spa Resort in Hakone offers its guests the pretty unique experience of splashing around in a vat of pork soup and ramen. What? Noodles. While this may sound crazy to many people, many, the Japanese believe that soaking in such a bath is good for the skin because a broth <laughs> of pork is rich in collagen. 3. Bizarre flavors of Kit Kat Chili pepper, wasabi, sweet potato, grilled corn, soybean, salt, watermelon, mango, green tea. So many! It's only a short list of the Kit Kat flavors you can try in Japan. Which one would you try? Let me know down in the comments fake food. Specialists make this kind of food from plastic or wax, and it looks just as delicious as the real one. Many restaurants it looks use real. fake food to display their popular dishes in the windows and attract hungry clients. Usually, these yes. replicas cost much more than the dishes they imitate. 5. Rabbit Island Back in the 40s, scientists brought a number of rabbits to Okonoshima Island to do some tests. However, later on, the animals were freed and started to multiply. Now the island is full of them and attracts a lot of tourists. Purakura machines. Taking Purikura. photos in a booth is not Purikura. Enough, but Japan added its own exciting twist to this experience. Their photo booths, called Purakura, allow you to edit photos right on the spot, adding different backgrounds, funny stickers, or writings. Also, you can send the pictures to your cell phone. Or perhaps your toilet, if, you know, you have Wi-Fi in there. You might never have to leave. 7. People pushers Yes. Subways and train stations get really overcrowded during rush hour. That's why the station staff and part-time workers have to perform the routine procedure of pushing people inside trains to mm. fit in as many passengers as possible Social distance. before the doors close. Number 8. Umbrella parking lot. Before going inside a building, you can park and lock your umbrella just like you do with your bike. Now you can be sure no one will take it, and you won't make a puddle on the floor if your umbrella is wet. Many government buildings, offices, and hotels have this sort of umbrella rack. 9. Millions of vending Nine. machines. Japan has more than 5 so million. So many. Of them. Mostly because they save time for people who work late hours, which is a pretty common thing here. Besides, Japanese vending machines aren't just for snacks and soda. You can buy mm, basically anything, from live lobsters to underwear in these machines. 10. Yes. Tokyo's biggest resident. In 2015, Godzilla, Godzilla. was granted citizenship in Tokyo's Shinjuku Ward. The authorities oh, really? presented a special certificate stating his new residency and also made him a job offer. Godzilla became the tourism ambassador. Later, they even installed a Godzilla head 171 feet above the ground at Toho, mm. the movie studio that made the original movie back in 1954. 11. Train delays make headlines. Punctuality is a really big thing here, and train stations do everything possible to avoid a delay. If a train is 5 mm. minutes late, the railway company might have to issue a delay certificate for railway workers and passengers who missed an important appointment. And if the delay is longer than an hour, then the railway company might give an official apology in newspapers. 12. Mm. Silent Karaoke This is a special microphone with a cone that you place over your mouth. It muffles uh, never the seen sounds this. when you sing. I don't know it was about designed this. designed for people who don't want to wake up their neighbors and those who feel shy about belting their favorite tunes in public. Number 13. Polite slurping. While in many countries, slurping is considered rude, in Japan, it's a way to show your appreciation of the dish. If you don't mm, slurp when you eat noodles, then the chef will think that you don't enjoy the food, 
or that it's cold. Ah, I don't know Chef noodles. Care, though. 14. Face napkins. When you eat a burger, Face napkins. it's never pretty because your mouth gets covered in ketchup or mustard. Owners of one fast food restaurant found a solution to this by serving burgers together with special napkins. They cover the faces of guests who feel what? a bit embarrassed about looking messy. <laughs> okay, okay. Eating. 15. Water saving sinks. They're located right over the toilet tanks. The idea is simple. First, you wash your hands over the sink, then the sink water goes straight into the toilet tank, and finally, you flush the toilet when you've done your business. So, you save water by using it twice. Aren't you glad they don't do it the other way? Number 16. Strange mayo. No, Japanese mayo doesn't have any special recipe or ingredient. But they don't eat it with salads, meat, or sandwiches. In Japan, People usually use it as a topping for ice cream or on pancakes. What? Mm, no, 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 not, not true, not true. Uh, nothing better. <laughs> this is so not true. Work. In Japanese culture, dozing off at the workplace, or in Amuri, is considered a sign of being a hard-working person who's very committed to their job. That's why in Amuri is so common, and no one thinks it's a bad thing. Some people really? even fake it. 18. World's shortest college, yes, yeah, school. You can find it in the basement of Moore's department store, which is located in the city of Kawasaki. The escalator has only five steps and is only 33 inches tall. Well, that's one small step for a man. Okay. 19. Canned food restaurant. Eating canned food may not sound like a delicious treat for you, but there's a whole chain of restaurants all over the country where they serve only canned food. They're pretty popular, since clients can choose from hmm. 300 varieties of food from all across the world. 20. Doll Village The village of Nagoro used to have a population of 300 people, but less than 40 residents live there now. A local artist, Tsukumi Ayano, made over 300 life-size dolls, most of which look like former residents, and they're located in various states of action. For example, there's a whole classroom of them in the village school that was closed a while ago. Number 21. No fours. It's common for mm. Japanese culture to avoid the number four, because it's considered to be very unlucky. That's why some buildings don't have a fourth floor, stores don't sell a set of cutlery for four, and the number of guests to some event can't be four. 22. Two. Blue traffic light. They use a blue color instead of green for traffic lights. The reason for that hides in their language. Historically, there was only one word for both colors. When traffic lights first appeared in the country, they were as green as anywhere else. But that green color was still called blue. To make things right, the government decided to use the bluest shade of green possible. Okay? Hmm. 23. Cleaning classes. Japanese kids learn how to clean in many schools because it's a part of their education. They mop their classrooms and hallways, do dusting, and even clean the bathrooms. Teachers believe it's a great way to raise responsible citizens. 24. Foot bath train. Take the Tsudoi tourist train to get the most comfortable sightseeing experience. This train has foot baths built of aromatic cypress oh, wood that's cool. with warm spring water that can soothe the pain in your joints. So, you can soak your feet and enjoy beautiful views at the same time while traveling from Nagoya to Yonoyama Onsen. 25. Futuristic Toilets Toilets in Japan are very high-tech. To use one, a person should know what all those buttons are for. There's a variety of functions, including heating the seat, spraying warm water to clean the user up, and even playing music. All they're missing is a refrigerator. Wow, who'd ever want to leave their toilet? 26. Crazy ice cream flavors. The Japanese love weird food combos. That's why finding an ice cream flavored with horse meat, cactus, charcoal, what? squid ink, garlic, or chicken wings won't be a problem. Uh, I never tried that before. 27. Never, never. Space-saving parking lots. Since Japan is a densely populated country, they don't like to waste space. That's why their parking lots have a smart system. They're designed like multi-level garages. 28. Mm. Robot-run hotel In a hotel in Nagasaki, robots are a big part of its staff. 
It's called the henna, which translates as strange. Okay. The human-like androids meet the guests, clean the rooms, carry luggage, make coffee, and even smile. However, real people work there too to recharge the robots and supervise how they perform hmm. their duties. Interesting. Cafe Companion Sitting alone in a cafe and enjoying your coffee and food is common for most people around the world. But in the land of the rising sun, you'll get a huge, plush moomin to sit next to you in one of the cafes, so you don't have to eat alone. Hey. Alright, so that was 29 things that only exist in Japan. Alright, so this, some of this is true, but some of this is not true, but it actually, I think it exists, but like, even if it exists, it doesn't mean that we Japanese people actually are like used to it or like we do this, you know what I mean? Like, like, and like the mild thing, it might exist, but like, you know, we never, none of, none of us actually eat it, but I feel. Yeah, so that was my reaction to it. It was really interesting. So if you guys have more videos you want me to check, please leave in the comment section below. Alright, so thank you for watching. If you like this reaction, please do thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and check out my videos. And also play some music and I'll do some Japanese lessons online. So please check that out as well. Alright, so thank you for watching today. See you. Ninja, ninja, ninja,